the objective of this job practice is to deposit a sound, full penetration, open root groove weld using a back and forth oscillation for the root bead and a 45 degree weave motion for the cover pass. Many joints of this type are accessible from only one side. 100% penetration with the root and cover passes is necessary to ensure soundness. This type of joint is used in tank and stack repair and large pipeline fabrication. Follow the general get ready steps. Use protective clothing, tools, and eye protection. The materials and power source settings for this exercise are listed in your workbook. Position two plates flat on the table in a parallel position. Insert a bare 3 seconds inch spacer wire one half inch in from each end. Hold the plates together to pinch the wire and make a small tack weld between the end of the joint and the spacer on each side of the joint. Remove the spacer and chip the slag. Then position a third plate with the spacer to form a second joint. Clamp the workpiece in the horizontal position about chest high. To deposit the first or root bead, start at the left side and position the electrode perpendicular to the workpiece. Then angle it five to 10 degrees in the direction of travel. Strike an arc near the edge of the plate, holding a long two diameter arc length to preheat the metal. Then move the electrode to the edge of the tack and shorten to one diameter. To obtain good penetration, hold a short arc length by pushing the electrode into the joint about one third the plate thickness, or so the coating touches the work. The arc length will melt out a circular shape in the base metal, forming what is called a keyhole. The size of this keyhole will indicate proper root penetration. It should be about two diameters wide. Correct travel speed will keep this size constant by filling as you travel. Use a slight back and forth motion, staying within the keyhole to help control the weld puddle and root penetration. Pause just long enough to fill the joint. Then move the electrode again. Move only your wrist for better control. Continue the same motion over the tack wells. If the joint spacing is too wide, slightly decrease the welding current. If the spacing is too narrow, slightly increase the current so that the root bead completely penetrates the joint. When the root bead is complete, thoroughly remove the slag and cool the workpiece in water. Use the 1 8 inch diameter E6010 electrode to deposit the second or cover bead over the root bead using a 45 degree weaving motion. Pause at the top side of the weave pattern long enough to fill the undercuts left by the root bead. When pausing, be careful not to hold the electrode stationary or allow the arc length to become longer than the normal one diameter. When the joint is complete, inspect the weld and continue practice. 